and welcome back to the game. <laughs> uh, what? How is that so? Please, whatever you found, don't tell mom and dad the attic. <sighs> Gone home? It's not that I don't remember. Uh, okay. Can't really run, which. I guess it's a good sign if you can't run in the foyer. Yep, basement. Basement is okay, I don't care. I don't mind that the basement is closed. Mm, since we, okay, so the rooms we haven't visited are not on the map yet. So still have second half of space to left to nope. I'm just gonna Nope, that's bad book. Uh, reminds me of the game The Suicidal of Richard Foster. Um, what about the family game? What about the one where we went to the abandoned hotel? It's so good to hear from you again. All this new house business sounds like quite the adventure. Remember the little dorm room we shared freshman year? When we were miserable fantasizing about our dream homes? I will say that I wanted to mention. You said you just wanted a house in the woods? Look who got above. Somebody up there likes you. I could use some of the magic. Send me some lotto numbers. I'll play them. Seriously. But I shouldn't be complaining about this good old split level we've had since Bob got transferred to Winnipeg. We just got new vinyl sli siding. Jealous yet? Let me know if you ever want to trade places. So how are the girls doing? Has Katie left on her big European adventure yet? Speaking of je jealous, right back soon. I miss you, Rumi. Oh. There's mm, another looked room. Okay, so... That's okay, that's the closet which I forget to close. Yeah, when we can't run, so we which means nothing's gonna face us. Boone County. Plums of smoke will rise above the northeastern region of Boone County over the better part of next week. As part of a for forest tree service run controlled burn of overgrown sections of the Flintlock National Forest. Forestry crews have been preparing the area for months. The burn operation will take place between 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and possibly into Thursday, depending on speed of progress, according to the first tree service. In addition to removing dead and overgrown vegetation that can lead to wildfires and dried moths, the operation will serve as a valuable training tool for the first tree and firefighting personnel involved, said senior controversialist Janice Greenbrier. Smoke will likely linger in the area through. The following weekend. Oh, there's the light switch. Cool, 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 cool. Monday couple bowling, bowling, Wednesday cooking class, fire ballroom dancing, and eight with beats. Cooking, cla oh, cooking class, ballroom dancing, cook the big meal for Terrence and all. I have to. Notice of temporary personal transfer. God damn it. The creaking door sounds like there's something. someone opening the door in my. Be right back. Okay, so I basically can hear every door creak that. when someone opens the door on the corridor outside my flat, and. plus the creaking door. creaking wood in the game. It may be paranoid, okay? Aid in the upcoming prescribed burn operation, a ranger with expertise expertise in the procedure is being transferred to the station at Flintlock National Forest, effective 9294. Please see attached personal file. Uh, the overseeing officer at Flintlock Forestry Station, Senior Conservationist Janice Greenbrier, is charged with supervision of transport personnel. 
The duration of transfer will be based upon performance evaluation as well as the recommendation of the overseeing officer. Okay, for a second though, I thought the light went out. Oops. It's weird hanging out with girls. Daniel was around ever since I was little, and other girls? I don't know. But being around Lonnie is like instantly just right. I gave her the grand psycho house tour and took my revenge on Super Nintendo. And it was like, I don't know, I finally found someone I feel normal around. I drove her home and she gave me this tape and said, you have got to listen to this. I haven't stopped playing it since. I, Samantha Greenbrier, am 17 years old and am Trevor an independent, fully functional human being. The fact that you still forbid me from going into the city on my own is frankly absurd. Compare with Katie, who is only 3 years older than me and yet you allowed her to go all the way across an ocean to another continent on her own. I just want... I just want Spain to spend an evening in a normal, totally safe city on my own, like a human being, and since you may also remember that I have my own car now, you can't really stop me. One as regards, your daughter, Samantha. Oh. Well, we might as well go through her stuff. Kick, 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 kick. Okay. Well, if we ever get to play, because apparently all. Oh, I hate those. Uh, apparently all of the players, like. Cassette play. No, the cassette player is still here. But video player or CD player are gone. Samantha Greenberg, the assignment, metalworking and engraving. Not challenging assignment, not all plague for family portrait, reasonable a subject but not complex. When I said that mom and dad should be replaced with parent names, I did not mean just add them underneath. Acceptable level of images show more. Per if that's supposed to describe that picture frame we have downstairs, I find it very nice. It's different, it's interesting. Is This is the one me and my dad are building. When I go for a ride when it's done, here's the exciting new brother 150. Bike with speed, style, and impressive get up and go. The brother 150 is reliable, four stroke engine produces speed that will surprise you. It's a beauty. Oh. Wait. Like, yeah, but ah, there was something else. Yeah, give me a second. Okay. Oh, I got no phone. Okay, I'm not reading that. Unless there's a code. I don't see any numbers though. Oh, that's cute. Uh, another Bible. Or Mitten. 1888. Oh, you're Mitten? I guess. Yes, I'm sorry about making a mess. Eight. Does this mean it's open? No. Okay. Something. Yep. Hi, 
Peroni, I wrote this in first period and left it okay and left it in your locker on the way on the second. It's what all the kids, cool kids are doing, I've decided. Write me back. Also, here's an idea for something to draw. Two cats on a motorcycle. Hey, it's a good idea. What all the cookies are doing is actually sending each other pages in their beepers. But we're cooling them then because guess what? They can put this on the beeper. The drawing of cats was so good that I added a background to make it even better. Maybe I should just stick to warning, writing though. Ah, uh, I like it. How did you know they were able to about to get abducted by aliens? I'm looking at Mr. Fish right now. I feel like he probably would have a lot, lot of cats. Also, like his secret shame that is that he waters 90210 religiously. I'm going to ask him about the cats after class. He said he has two cats and also that he's never watched 10210, but I could see his eyes were lying. That's a cool cat. Well, I can't really put those numbers in here. No. Yeah. Um, I think the creative writing track perfect for you. Okay. Mm -mm. <laughs> no. Uh, no, I'm just not reading all that. Wait, we have two ways into your room? Yeah? Apparently. Hey Sam, do you want to see Pulp Fiction after school at the Coliseum? It came out last week and, and Todd won't shut up about it, so it's either good or we can make fun of him for liking it. My mom is supposed to cook dinner for us tonight for a change, but I can just dish out on it probably. What time? Also, isn't that movie supposed to be really violent? Am I going to barf? According to that, it is pretty hardcore. I guess Uma Thurman gets stabbed in the heart of a heroin needle, so that's kind of hilarious. Adrenaline needle. Heroin? Eh. Also, something about cheeseburgers is important. I think Toad's going to come to see... Uh, going to come so he can see it again, if that's okay. 7.15, okay? Don't barf. Maybe it was hurry. I'm one of those that didn't really enjoy this movie. But then again, I don't really like Tarantino's movies. What the heck? No, not the false. The, those. Okay, that explains a lot. Lonnie brought her hair dye over today. She said, I need to fix these roots. Think you could help? Dying hair is weirdly intimate. I don't know if I've touched someone else's scalp before. It's pretty intimate, right? It felt intimate. We looked in the mirror together after, and I expected her to say something about how it looked crappy, or good, or whatever. But that's when she said, You're so beautiful. And she was looking at me. Right in that moment, I wanted to say something. But I waited, and the moment was gone. And another Bible, this is really getting on my nerves. Um, because I have a bad feeling about that. That's it. Also, and not no okay no video player again Then so what do we have here where's my mitten I seriously I took it okay never mind don't 
from mine. Okay. Let me catch you. Okay, on the second one, don't look much under the bed. Who keeps their clothes so stuck down there? Oh honey, let me tell you, understand how you feel. Bob and I have our have had our down periods. It's become a bit of a way of life actually. You get used to each other. You live your your own lives in the same house. The kids grow up, they go away. I'm sorry this isn't helping, is it? Don't worry. Uh there we will get over whatever is distracting him. Things will go back to normal. And as for some being distant, that's a teenager for you. Nothing to worry about. In the meantime though, this controlled burn that sounds like quite the adventure. But let's cut to the chase. The new ranger that they sent that's what I want to hear about, Ranger Rick. You have to be kidding me. It's so perfect. You have to tell me everything and send pictures. I want the whole package. Wait, that one sounded wrong. Keep your chin up until Terry is out of his slump. And in the meantime, write more letters to your old friend Carl. She adores them. Not creepy at all. What goes? Ooh. Nice. Actually, try to learn what a clue wants. Here. No, thank you. No. My adventure photo course. Well, it turned out quite fine. I made two tattoos, and that's about it. I hate you. 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 Okay. Now explain this to me. Why separated? After the honeymoon. Hmm. I like this. <laughs> now the only thing left. Oh, okay, the TV is in the closet. It's really. In Sam's room, the locker. Mom, okay, mom and dad were going to make up the guest room for you to stay in over the summer, but you came home on such short notice that they weren't around to do it. You can use my room if you want, I won't be needing it anymore. Why? Oh, wait. The creep. No, nope, not yet. Position, but okay. Uh, a tall shadow in the upstairs hall. When I rounded the corner, no one was there. How tall was Uncle, Uncle Oscar? Note, I was not wearing my glasses. I faint a voice coming from the bottom of the stairs. I said, Hello, they don't investigate. Or it was the furnace. Poured milk from carton and fridge. It was spoiled. Pretty sure I read that spirits can store milk. Milk was just bought yesterday. Okay. Lori says she feels a presence in the TV room. I suddenly begin to feel cold. We build a protective pillow for it. Lori and I employ a Ouija board as a medium. Disturbing messages are conveyed from the other side. Oscar definitely here. And I listed Lori to stay up all night on her patrol premises, recording any signs of otherworldly presence. Lori reported many sightings, but all remained unconfirmed. Possible ectoplasm in attic, probably due to leaky roof. Sample taken, just in case. Despite our best efforts, we both fell asleep around 4 a.m. All in all, a successful night. Okay, I guess this is all my stuff. I'm glad you can run. You can't run. Oh, guess that player. Miss evaluation. Okay. Ranger pattern match has been 
indispensable during the course of the prescribed burn preparation and execution. I believe his expertise and dedication has been the de deciding factor in the success of a very complex and challenging conservation effort. In the opinion of the Flintlock Forest staff, Rick's contributions to daily operations have become essential to the outfit's continuing success. To this end, I will be formally submitting paperwork requesting his permanent reassignment to this facility. Oh. Well, it's a different but for me to say anything about this howling show. Don't forget your costume, the misfits. Okay. Oh. Sometimes you just have to lie to mom and dad. Like when Lonnie asked me to see a band with her and stay over at her friend's place in the city after. That's a lie to mom and dad situation. But it was so worth it. The girls on stage were just so loud and real and awesome. And everybody was moving together like one huge tide of sound. Between two songs, Lonnie leaned over and said, how do you like your first show? I was so happy. I felt tears starting in my eyes. And then she up and hugged me. I think she could tell. Drop the high pitch on me, we're fine. <laughs> yeah, I, I won't be able to really listen to all those. Just in case, I won't listen to those. Bonnie, holy crap, I was in the library and I noticed something in the corner and I found a secret passage and it had all scores creepy old stuff in it. Oh my god, I have to get to see this. We're skipping sixth. Mom and the. What the frick? The library? Okay, we're definitely checking that out first. <gasps> I, my, we have one of those. It's so epic, but okay, we have all, all the one. An allegra and the first mate. Oh, you made it yourself. That's cool. That's very cool. Yeah, not yet. Now that I know. There's something in their closet, I really don't want to enter it, but... Uh. Remember when I said that I don't really want to see it? Ghost Hunter, summon Lonely Secret House Investigation Lock, hidden compartments found free, library, Upstairs hall, foyer, evidence of the supernatural discovered. Your room. Okay, you put all of them, okay. Any more crosses? Got it. Holy shit, that scared me. Yeah. <sighs> Wait, no. Um. Do not read. Okay. Allegra and her scouting party peer down for whirly through the dance canopy over. Okay, no, I won't read it. <sighs> yes! 
what's in this one? There's... It's in the library. Sorry, don't worry. Okay, it will be fine. It will be fine. We're safe. Okay. Misfits. At Todd's brother's place after the show, there was only a futon to sleep on, so Lonnie and I shared it. The lights went out. I was turned toward her, my eyes started to adjust, and then I could see she was looking at me, too. In the dark, she smiled. My heart was beating so fast. I rolled over, I felt so, I don't know, nervous? After a minute, she put her arm around me, and was so close, and whispered in my ear, I really like you. I just nodded my head, and I really hoped she could tell. I really hoped that she meant what I think she did. I felt like a shook-up can of soda ever since. I hope we have the chance to talk before I explode. Oh, it's over here. No, <laughs> no, 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 I really hate it. Okay, we have to part. I'm not touching the Ouija board. Oh, uh, nope. Mm -mm, I'm not picking the Ouija board. Oh, in hell. O fifteen one to open. Turn first number. Then right three times, but turn. O fifteen one, okay. Open turn right three times. Stop at first number. The right is one. Turn left one. Turn right and stop at second number. Pull shackle and stop at third number. It gave me nothing. Oh, Within 150. What was that? 151. 051. Thank you. Well, I came over today. But everything was different. She was sitting at my desk chair and she wouldn't look at me. Finally, I asked her what was going on. She said she felt like she'd done something wrong that night in the city. Like I must think. But I said, no, there was nothing wrong. I just wanted to say... But I couldn't find the words. I felt like I was going to cry, but I wasn't sad. She got up and sat next to me on the bed. I looked at her. Lonnie, do you think you could ever... And that's when she kissed me. <laughs> okay, I'm glad, you're glad, sure. But why the hell do you keep basement key in your... Uh, No, no, you know what? No, never mind. Okay, that's it for today. I'm done. I hate ghosts. Well, I hate this, but we're going to touch it next day, the next time. So for now, thank you very much. Your life, and see you soon. Bye.